All right, so sorry for the long absence. Uh, I had a lot of exams, basically, I finished uni now, which is good, but in that time, and then I didn't make too many videos, but I was still out and about looking at some things on the internet. And anyway, what I found out about 105DI2, I'm gonna share with you now. So first off, we got this picture from Weight Weenies, um, which is from a, a German or Austrian manufacturer. Oh, sorry, uh, it's like shop. And you can see here, they've got DI2 105. Um, this is like, basically the brakes um and the front shifter sorry yeah the front shifter and calipers which are like 370 760 euros each which is a lot the flat mount and you can see the adapter 68 euros um then you can see this is the rear derailleur i believe which is 250 euros which again is quite a lot um but yeah they look pretty expensive stuff actually this all might be the shifters i think these could all be the shifters i'm not 100 percent sure but anyway it seems pretty Pretty expensive to me. Oh yeah, no, sorry. That is the front derailleur, the two by um, DIG wireless front shifter and then rear shifter as well. Um, but anyway, we can go have a look at like how much is it gonna cost? Well, obviously that's the price that you can buy it for on the internet, but obviously, you know, the Shimano has big discounts, but it was gonna come on a bike that's like two and a half K you can see here. So no changing gear ratios. So 50, 34, pretty standard. 105 DI2 R7, 150, 12 speed. Um, and then, yeah, you can sort of see the, the cassette ratio. We've got an 1134 here, two by 12. So you can see like 105 DI2 is coming. Um, I predict it was hit yesterday, which luckily it hasn't because otherwise uh, this video would be a bit dead. Um, but yeah, that's the sort of information. So you can see like the braking is the 7170. Um, so I guess that's what the group says is going to be called 7100. And then there'll be various different iterations of that. Um, here's Snake again, you, if you just look at the top, the top bit you can see here that they've got front derailleur r1750 um lined up like obviously it's not on the website yet but it will be present um and then we've also got a felt now if you look closely you'll be like this is the juries obviously they just want a picture of the bike but again you can see this is a slovenian and oh no, a czech republic website um and this again felt ir 105 di2 if we look at like what one hundred fifty thousand um czech crowns are um i believe it's like 6,000, so quite a lot, which is, what but maybe bikes in Czech Republic are really expensive, I'm not 100% sure. Um, but anyway, this is, this this they might be getting confused with DI2, but you know, one, uh, again, uh, 105 DI2 are uh, 7150. So again, it's definitely turning up. Um, we now got a cassette as well, which again is 1134, um, which may be the standard one, which I think is probably quite good. A 12 speed 1134 would be pretty sweet. Um, so anyway, I guess the question is, what, what do I make of all of this? Well, I haven't really seen any pictures of it, which is obviously disappointing. Um, but in terms of like it being DI2 being and 12 speed for 105, I think it has to happen. I think Axis really are gonna like start to eat up more the market, especially at rival level, because people love the electric. Um, gears and Shimano didn't have it. So I think it was natural Shimano going to go. Um, it's good they haven't uh, gone on to any dodgy um, like ratios. I think the ratios as is are good, just have closer gaps. And then, you know, you can go for a, a either easier cassette on the rear um, without having a massive gap. So anyway, those are my thoughts here. Um, 105 DI2 is turning up. Not 100% sure when, um, probably soonish, I would imagine. Um, you won't hear anything from this from the main bike manufacturers because it'll be so close to sorry, publications, it'll be so close to them uh, like releasing it that they'll have to sign an NDA and won't be able to cover it, which is why, you know, there's minimal talk about it. But it's obvious that it's turning up um, very, very soon. So anyway, cheers for watching. Hope you enjoy. There's going to be many, many, many more videos on the way. Um, and I'll see you in the next one.